Hey cute people, yes, it's the new year, we're four days in, four days into the new year, and I have to say, I don't know why, but I seem to feel a lot more excited about this year than I had previous years, I don't know why, I really don't know why, but I wanted to make this video more to say Happy New Year to a lot of people because a lot of you have been showing me a lot of support and love this year and previous years but I really really wanted to say Happy New Year to you guys because I haven't done much in the last couple of months because I've been working sick and tired tired sick and working whichever order you want to put it in I've been doing it all and I'm just trying to take care of my health. But I just wanted to say Happy New Year because I needed to. Because the new year to me is like a fresh start. I mean, you can have a fresh start on June 16th if you want to. But a new year, new start, new dreams, new goals, prosperity, good health, good luck, all that. January 1st, right? So we're in the new year four days in, and so far I haven't really decided what it is exactly that I wanted to do. But one thing I will say for sure, I want to this year, I have to this year, I hope I can this year, start back to earning a degree. I really, really want to do that. I hope I can make that happen for myself. I don't know when or how, how or when, but I really hope that I can. I've been to two different mm, higher education schools, I'll call them, and I've never completed my degree. I've been to City College one semester, and I also did Queens Community College straight out of high school for one year, and I didn't complete that either. And I just want to earn a degree. That's a lifetime goal for me. I don't know if I should put it on my bucket list. Maybe I will because you never know. I may complete that degree when I'm 80 years old, but I'm going to get it done. I'm going to get it done. I'm coming right back here to YouTube and I'm going to let you know I did it. But I'm going to do my best anyway. But this video isn't really about too much of anything. Like I said, I just really wanted to say Happy New Year. I had so many videos that I wanted to do at the end of the year, and I didn't do them. Same thing with the beginning of the year, and I haven't done them. But one thing I can say for sure, if anything, I'd like to wish you all a Happy New Year. Over the course of last year, I had saved a lot of empties. I don't do empty videos. I intended to do them, but I didn't. So I have a lot of empties I want to share with you. Yeah, I'm going to do like an end of the year empty video. And I'm going to make it fast. And I'm going to make it short. Like today I wanted to do a video. Because I don't do much makeup on camera. Because I need great light, good light, sunlight. And today here in New York, if you live in New York or if you're even on the East Coast, you know it's like really dreary and dark and I told you before I have the darkest apartment in New York so that wouldn't work because you wouldn't be able to see anything I guess I could have done it anyway but it really would not be the same and if you're interested in what I have on my lips today you know what I'm wearing fixed on drama by Mac and I lined my lips with NYX's cabaret which you probably can't see because is down to the nibby nibby nub nub. But this is what cabaret looks like. And I'll swatch fixed on drama for you too. And you can see how close it is to the liner. There we go, there we go, there we go. And I just put that on my lips today because usually when it's dark like this, I like to put on something bright. Although this is not really bright, but it's not, um, okay, it's not bright, but I put it on anyway. But I just wanted to share it with you guys in case you were interested in what I had on my lips. And these earrings, aren't they just really, really pretty? I got these earrings a couple of years ago from Sweet Georgia Browning. I think she was selling them, and I had did a video on some 
jewelry that I bought from a beauty supply store. And she liked some of the bangles that I have um, showed in the video. So she wanted to do a swap. So we did a swap. I sent some her, her some bangles and she sent me these earrings and it was another pair also. And I thought these were so cute. I like the chains and you see the leaves here. And I wear them from time to time when I want to be cute. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And check out the hair, y'all. Look at my hair. It probably could be bigger than this, but I didn't fluff it out with the pick. I just took the twist out, and this is it. But it's really, really growing. You know, there's a funny thing. I wish I had went natural before <laughs> I did because I'm at the age now, yes. That's how old I am. And I think my hair is starting to thin now. You really wouldn't notice it that much, but I do. Because it just doesn't feel the same. It still looks full. I hope I'm 80 years old and still have full hair. If I'm not, I just have to deal with it because that's the way it is, right? But, um, yeah. So, I wish that I had went natural earlier in life because I would have had a full, thick, bush of hair. Like, you wouldn't even be able to put your hands through it. That's how my hair used to be as far as um, getting your hand through, like, the roots. I couldn't I couldn't do it before. I mean, I had so much, ooh, it was just so thick. And it's still thick like that now, but I can feel my scalp now. So, I don't know. But I love the bigness. So, usually when I take the twist out, I don't pick it. I just take the twist out and just flip it, fluff it the way I want it. And that's it because... Of the thickness, I really don't have to, but I guess if I picked it out, I could make it fuller, bigger. But I like it like this. This is cool for an old lady, right? This is this is not bad. And I'll leave it like this. I don't know if you guys um are following or or you're doing the 100 days of happiness or 100 happy days. I had always been interested in it, so I decided to do it this year. I started on the first today, like I said, it's the fourth, so I did four days already and I'm just putting little things I don't care how small it is I don't care what it is I don't care if it's a lipstick that makes me happy or a TV show that makes me happy or the weather going outside seeing the sun that day whatever it is I'm gonna post it as making me happy whatever it is that makes me happy I'm gonna put it on my Instagram I'm not really really heavy heavy with Instagram I do like it I do like to look at other people's pictures I don't post as much as I would like to but I really really like to look at other people's um, pictures and stuff so I try to subscribe to as many people as I can I need to subscribe to more people to tell you the truth so if you want to subscribe to me and it's not like subscribe to me I'll subscribe to you I don't want to say it that way but if you want to look me up look me up it's ebony girl speaks and of course if you say hi to me i'll definitely say hi back because it's not like i have a lot of followers i can't keep up with people but you know if you want to leave in the comment section who you are and your page so other people can see it and myself you know do that down in the comment section i'll come out and stroll and say hi to you and all that good stuff and we can dialogue. You know how we New Yorkers talk, right? We can dialogue, go back and forth. You know what I'm saying? I could do better than that. I really can, but I'm just going to leave it that way. But, yeah, so, like, um, I'm just trying to do... If, if anything this year I want to do is just find a really simple job so I can get out of my house. Yeah. And just... Because I miss being around people. That I have to say, I really do miss being around people. And going back to school, I really want to go back to school. But you know the funny thing is, I don't know what I want to study. I should know that, right? But I don't. Okay, I don't want to make this video too long because I can ramble. People always tell me, you can talk a lot. Not really. I only talk when I have something to say. I want you to know that. You know those people who can talk? And you know they're just talking because they just want to hear themselves or want you to hear them say something. You're like, did she really just say that? You know, she's just saying it because she just want to be heard. I'm not that person. I only talk when I have something to say. So we could be together, hanging out. And I could talk, 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 talk. And then there's a time you'd be like, oh, wow, she's really quiet. Yeah. Mm-hmm. 
ahead and watch that. But there's so many things that I want to do here in my city because there's so much to do. There's a lot of things that I, myself, as a native New Yorker, haven't, you know, visited, seen, taken part of. I've never watched a ball drop in Times Square. I remember years ago, it was like one of those places you dreaded to go because there used to be a lot of crime happening. Maybe not so much now because I don't hear too much of um, any equipment activity years ago. Yeah, you did. But there's so many things I want to do. Here we are in 2015, so I'm going to try to take you guys with me as much as I can. I would really like to do that because sharing your life or parts of your life, whatever you, it is that you want to share, just things that you do. Something so simple. It doesn't have to be anything complex, right? It's just really fun. I watch a lot of vlogging videos and some of the people that I watch are so interesting. Like one person I watch and I love, love her videos. It's Ghana Goddess, Miss Cinnamon Kate. I love her, her vlogging videos. She does a lot. I don't do anything. That's why I don't vlog. Because I don't do anything. But again, this video really is just say, just to say to everybody, especially those who show me love and support. And even if you don't show me love and support on a regular, this is still for you. So maybe I shouldn't have said that, but I did, so I'm not gonna take it back. But I wanted to wish everybody a happy new year. Because we're already four days now. There's so much that I want to do on YouTube. I hope I find the time to do it. But if I do, great. If I don't, that's not too great. But I'm going to do my best. Because there's a lot of things I just want to share. My journey in life with you guys. That's it, pretty much. And I just wanted to wish you guys a happy new year. Hopefully you're having a great one. If it hasn't started off great so far, that it end really great for you guys. Healthy prosperous, good luck, success, dreams being met, goals being set and met, and all that good stuff, because I'm really big on dreams, goals, setting them. I'm really big on those things. But I just wanted to say Happy New Year to you guys. I really, really hope that I can get my behind here sooner than I've been doing, and that each time I make a video, I won't have to say, I know, I've been going for quite some time. <laughs> One day I'm going to stop saying that. Because YouTube to me is just fun. A lot of fun. So I'm going to end this video here. And I'm going to say to you all, thank you so much for stopping by and watching this video. And hopefully I'll see you in the next. And I'd like for you all to share and spread love.